March now gone, so you know what that means. Another month, another haul. Hello everyone and welcome to Anything Geek, my name is Zero and even though OPL6 just got out this month and I had to buy my obligatory two boxes, I still managed to buy some cool things on the side, so here they are. And the brand first in one of these videos that I make is gonna be a vinyl. More specifically here the Lost Demos from Linkin Park. This is the vinyl where they've released Lost Fighting Myself and More the Victim, which are previously unreleased tracks that they've actually produced during the Meteora era. It's uh, It's been over 20 years actually because Meteora is 20 years old. I have to say like being a big fan myself of Linkin Park it was so cool that that they did those reissues of Meteora and uh, being able to have now some unreleased song is very cool and they actually just released another uh, vinyl with some other new songs that they've made, Friendly Fire, and those are just like absolute bangers. Rest assured though that this vinyl is not alone because not so long ago a friend of mine actually gifted me the actual Meteora album on vinyl as well. I've been searching for this particular vinyl for so long and they've actually made a reissue of the album along with the unreleased track and so my friend just found the perfect timing to, to give this to me for my last birthday and it has been very cool to be able to listen to this on vinyl. This album has had such a huge impact on me growing up being a teen. It helped me through one of the darkest periods of my life so it's pretty cool. I like them a lot. And if you followed my video up until now, you're no stranger to the fact that I am buying a, an absolute ton of mangas. So of course, I bought one more. But this is actually special, okay? I don't have all the previous issues. I have up until the 15th volume and the 22nd as well because it was um, collector's edition just like this one. And so I had to pick this up right now before they ran out of it so as not to miss on it. So let me just open this so I will be able to share a bit of the content with you guys. And also if you followed my video before you know that uh, you know which particular series this is. This is Love Dilemma. This is the manga that had uh, the infamous uh, Domestic Girlfriend adaptation. So to take a closer look at this I'm gonna switch to my top view camera here and so you can have a close look at the cover and you get a sneak peek at the art inside. Beware though this is for like not kid person let's say. Let's take a look. Of course I'm not gonna spoil anything story-wise because I myself am not caught up with the story yet. So you have the front cover right here with Ina and you have the back cover here with Rui. And if you know anything about, oh yeah, of course. And if you know anything about this particular series, you know that uh, behind that dust cover, there's always something special. So we're gonna see if I can show this on screen or not. Yeah, I can not. Uh, yeah, I can totally. I totally cannot show this. Yeah, I can totally, absolutely not show this on screen. But uh, hey, there's other ways to get you to see a bit of this. And that's through the membership of the channel where I can actually post sneak, sneak peeks of this on the Discord. So if you want to join, feel free to do so. But this is what we wanted. This is the collector item of this thing. And it's a collection illustration. So. I'm already scared that I'm not going to be able to show you guys any of this. I mean, for now it seems like pretty decent, but let's see. So let's take off the dust cover. What do we have? It's the same illustration, so no surprise there, but uh, let's, gonna, let's take a peek inside. And those are going to be all the color, um, color panels that have been shown throughout the manga. So I'm not going to show too much because I don't want to spoil myself or spoil any of you who might follow the series. But uh, I think for now there's no spoiler. So that's cool. Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, I can't really show this as well. So yeah. Ooh, oh, that one is fire. 
I cannot show it as well, but you gotta trust me, it's fire. They seem okay, um, spoiler-wise. They're not see they, they doesn't seem to be spoiling anything of the story, so that's cool. I'm gonna show you guys as much as I can, of course, if you wanna enjoy the show. Oh, that's definitely not happening on YouTube, bro. Yeah, no, that's definitely not gonna make it on YouTube. Yeah, that's also not gonna end up on YouTube. Guys, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm gonna post this somewhere else. Uh, make sure to follow me on my social if you want to see a bit more of that. Yeah, you get some fire here. It's, a, it's actually a very cool, a very cool little art book. But of course I can't really show you like all of those because of the nature of the content. Remember, not for non-adult. And I like the illustration as well. I do have, um, I do like the character a lot. Oh yeah, yeah, that's also gonna be blood. Very cool little booklet with all the color illustration. And if you know nothing about Love Dilemma, the manga and the anime, I suggest you check it out uh, when you have the time, of course. If you're a kid watching this, don't. But if you're any other person which is of a decent age for this type of things, check it out, it's very good. I, I actually like the story a lot. Also, it just helps that the opening of the anime is just such a banger. And the last project that we are gonna have is something that I found in my local shop where I buy all my mangas. And uh, it's a medal collection of, the, of just the One Piece anime. And it is so cool. That is another thing that I'm gonna spend too much money on. Let's switch again to the top camera. And so this is the pack where you have the folders and you have two medals inside. And then you're gonna buy each medal separately. And there's just like all these medals that you can collect. So of course, I'm gonna have only two medals in this thing. So I'm gonna have to buy all the rest, but if I wish for any pulls in the medals that I have, it's gonna be like Gold Roger, Chanks, Luffy, Zoro, or Nami. It's gonna be one of those that I'm gonna wish for, but we're gonna see what we get inside. So let's open this. It's actually a very cool album. You get, and you get the two packs here with the coins. Let's put that there. So, two packs with one coin each, and you have this little folder right here. Where oh, that's so cool! And you can input all the coins here. That's actually very cool. Bro, that's a huge pile of gold as well that they're sitting on. That's very cool. Let's uh, let's just open these, see what medals we have, and if I don't have what I want, actually, who am I kidding? I'm gonna need to buy all the coins, so I I'm gonna buy this stuff again in the near future. But we're gonna see first with what we have here. Try not to look, not to spoil myself. And there's seems to be like this. I'm not gonna look at the coin yet. And so we have, yeah. So you have a little tracking thing here for your coins. That's cool. That's very cool. So let's see what coin we got first. And it's gonna be. 
Oh, we got Zoro. Nice. First coin, and we got one of the MVPs. Nice. That's so cool. And there's actually a very cool illustration also at the back. I'm going to try to pick it up on screen. And I wonder if this is different for each character because this this one does seem to have like a katana up front. So I wonder. But for now, we have Zoro, so this goes right here. Let's input that in the album. This is damn this sure is a tight fit. That's what she said. Let's put that aside and let's go with the second coin. Okay, so what we're gonna have next? I'm way off screen. Who is that? I don't see. That's the back of the coin, of course. Now it's up front. Who are we gonna get? Nami, nice. So we got two of the coins that we wanted first. That's very cool. And she's got all of the tangerines around her in the design. That's very cool. That's a very cool collection to do on the side of the One Piece card game. I'm very happy that they do this. They're, they also have some Naruto ones, but I'm not that big of a fan of Naruto, so I'm not gonna do that. But the one piece, of course, I was going to do it. It's, it's, it really is a tight fit, guys. I'm not even joking this time. Okay, finally in. So there we go. A little album with already two coins in that. I'm going to have to buy other booster packs to complete that collection. But it's, it's going to be very cool. And it really helps that the coins are very, very good looking. Look, you can see that Nami over here and the Zoro hiding my ugly face right behind my arm here. That is so cool. That is very cool. So there you go, guys. This was a short one because, of course, OPO6 has been released this month. And yeah, I bought my two boxes and two double packs, which I opened on the channel. So if you want to see more openings of One Piece stuff, you can make sure to check out those videos next.